guys, welcome to the PlayStation 3 news. I got a ton to talk about, so I'm going to talk pretty quick. Sorry if you can't understand, and jump right into it. Uh, Gamescon, that just happened, uh, the Meteor Molecule announced that Little Big Planet will be getting water in their game. It looks awesome. And if you want to get into a Little Big Planet water beta, all you got to do is sign up at Meteor Molecule's website and just fill out a form. Also, DJ Hero has a North American release date coming out October 27th. And the rest of the world by the end of that month. They didn't give a date. And also, Polyphony Digital says that uh, Gran Turismo 5 is to release shortly after Gran Turismo PSP. That's pretty much all I said. No reason for that. And Final Fantasy XIII is, has a release date for Europe. It's going to be coming out in spring 2010. There's no exact month yet, but they gave uh, a little more details saying that the story is going to last uh, 50 plus hours. I don't know why my camera's screwing up either. Sorry about that. And Home version 1.3 is going to be coming in September. It's going to be awesome for all you guys who like to frequent PlayStation Home. Uh, I'm going to go through the list of the features real quick. It's going to have universal game launching, a free camera for you to take pictures of, and it's going to be saved to your XMB in a photo section. It's going to have new emotes, new poses, new clothing categories, new queuing system, and a new optimized targeting system. So it's going to make Home even better. And also, Dark Void is going to release January 12th, 2010 in North America, and January 15th in Europe. And also, play, uh, PlayStation Network cards are coming to PAL territories later this, sometime this year, they, uh, Sony has stated. No uh, exact date, but just saying that sometime this year. And also, Battlefield Bad Company 2 has a release date of March 2nd, 2010 in North America, and March 5th, 2010 in Europe. So, that game's looking to be awesome. Make sure you mark down your calendars. Pick that game up. And also, RPG fans. Uh, you're probably pretty excited about Resonance of Fate. Uh, and I'm sure, like, you RPG fans, I know you love your games real long. They have stated that Resonance of Fate is going to have over 150 hours of gameplay. It's fucking long as hell. And also, the Mag Beta, which I believe started August 17th. It uh, might be too late to get into because they already enclosed beta, but they stated that if you want to get into the beta of MAG, that just become a core subscriber. Uh, MAG will be going into two more stages of beta, so whenever it goes into it, I'll let you know how you can get into it. And the biggest news to come out of GamesCon, is, most of you already know, is the PlayStation 3 Slim is true. All the rumors are true. The worst kept secret at Sony. Uh, the features of it is going to have a 120GB hard drive, it's going to be 32% smaller, 36% lighter, 34% more efficient, and all PS3s right now are only $299. Uh, but the only downside about it that I know some people did not know is that it will replace the fat PS3. The current ones out there right now are getting liquidated and being replaced by the slim PS3. And it's going to be launched on September 1st. And if you want to know my opinion, a lot of my PSN buddies already know, is that I don't really like the PS3 Slim. Uh, if you ask me, it's like a downgraded PS3. It, they got rid of all the great cosmetic features that make that made the current PS3 more the most modern-looking system. Uh, you know, they they using all the flat uh, flat black, which makes it look cheap instead of metallic or the piano finish black. Uh, they no longer have silver accents, and they have that new PS3 logo engraved in it which I don't really care for either. And they also, the touch buttons, which is like the most modern thing on it, which I love, the touch-sensitive uh, panel on there for the power button and eject button are not being replaced by just actual buttons. And I couldn't tell, but judging by looking at the pictures, I couldn't see any lights either for the power and like the disc when you put in the blue and green lights. So personally, I don't like it, but hey, you all have your own opinions. And also, last bit of news is that firmware... Firmware 3.0 is going to be coming out, uh, I forget the date, but it's going to have animated XMB themes, which look amazing. It's going to also add uh, what's new section and a whole shit list of more stuff. It's going to just be a ton more shit. And if you want the full details, uh, I don't have enough time to list, is uh, check out the PlayStation blog and watch the videos of the walkthrough of everything about the new firmware update. I'm sure you guys would love it. That's pretty much what's been going on. So, uh, you know, quite a bit. I know I talked pretty fast. Just repeat the video. <laughs> but anyway, rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next week. All right? Peace.